Well, this is a 2019 um, Audi Q3 um, Premium Plus, and this car is really awesome, but one of the even amazing features is the uh, garage door opener. Now, traditional systems, what they call home link, it usually have like a three button system that kind of sits here on the top or somewhere on the bottom, but now it's built into the infotainment system. So if you tap here and you could see your, your, um, your car, your garage door there, you tap on this and it would bring you the whole list. But of course, you can also go down here to vehicle and um, it is, oh yeah, yeah, here. So settings, go to garage door opener. And then we already did the left, we're gonna program the right. So you just tap on here to add it. And so you're gonna have, we have here the Genie system. So you're just gonna basically, in the, in the past, you have to put it in front of the vehicle front, but it's even gotten simpler. Now you have to just hold it in front of your um, rear view mirror. Hold it a couple seconds until the screen changes. And you hear like in past systems, it would kind of click the emergency lights for a little bit. It did that here too, which is insane. We're gonna now synchronize it. You can see the garage are kind of closed too, which is because of this. So synchronize now. And this is so confusing because it thinks, um, hit the button twice and we were so stumped about this, but you're not gonna hold this button twice. You're actually gonna hold this button twice here. You're gonna hold it for a couple of seconds, um, for maybe like two seconds. And you can see the car's not moving. I mean, the garage door is not moving. So we're gonna click on no and what we we're gonna have to do now, I'm gonna take the phone. I'm gonna show you guys that there is a, uh, there's our A3. You gotta go to the actual unit and hit the sync button. This is one right here. Until you see the light turn blue and then release and it blinks. So we're gonna go back. again oh. and it's not moving hold for a couple seconds garage door is still not moving but you want to keep on doing this for a little bit and then eventually you start seeing it move so it is working so now again you have to keep putting holding this button down because again <laughs> it's confusing there was no button but it's this little button on top right. Now you see it's moving because it's synced with the sync button. Now you click on yes. And now, um, we already did this. We're not gonna store the GPS because we did it for the left garage door. But it's even more insane because now when you pull up to the garage door, it's automatically gonna open. That's insane. So just click on X because we don't need that. Uh, click yes to finish the wizard. And there you go. So you tap on there and you can see the garage door is opening and closing now, but you don't have to be to the screen. If you go back to the home button and tap on the status, the settings menu here, this is our main garage door, but if you want to get to the more other garage doors, you get to hit this button here. I guess it takes a couple of seconds to, to load, but um, that'll take us to Okay, I don't know why it's not. Well, it doesn't matter. So we just click on here and see the garage door is now opening and closing. So that's our tutorial on how do you figure out the garage system. Hope it helps. All right, so we figured it out. Actually, you gotta hit this button here and then you can see all the other garage doors.